Insect pollinators are really important for food security. Their contribution to the production of lots of different crops like oilseed rape, strawberries, field beans um, is crucial. And actually in the UK, insect pollination services have been valued at in excess of £430 million per year. In our first study, we were trying to um, measure the contribution of insect pollinators to apple production in the UK. We know that insects are important for production of apples, they uh, enable pollination of apple flowers, but what we don't know is, it, is the value of this insect pollination to UK apple production. The results of the study showed that we're also able to value insect pollination to the production of gala and cox apples, and actually we showed that insect pollination is worth over £36 million to these two varieties alone. We also showed that currently the pollination demands of some of our apple varieties, gala for example, are not currently being met by uh, pollination services in our orchards. So these varieties in particular would benefit from pollinator management to improve apple production and apple quality. Another study we've been doing is looking at trying to identify which pollinators are really important for the pollination of oilseed rape and field beans, which are two really important UK crops. Our research has shown your management needs to be targeted to those pollinators that are going to be effective pollinators of these crops. For example, uh, to improve pollination of beans, you might want to um, um, manage uh, bumblebee abundance and diversity in the field. For oilseed, they're pollinated by a very diverse community of pollinators. The third project we've been conducting at Reading has been looking at the contribution of honeybees or the potential contribution of honeybees to providing pollination services to crops and we've explored this over 41 countries including the UK and all of the EU and found that in 22 of them there were insufficient honeybee stocks to actually pollinate all these crops. Um, if honeybees were to be the only pollinator of crops in the UK we would need another 1 million colonies in the UK alone and the UK is second only to Moldova in its shortfall. We only have around a quarter of the honeybees in this country that we would need to provide pollination services to all of our crops. And most of this um, has been exacerbated by the expansion of oilseed rape, particularly in the last five years with the introduction of um, EU biofuel policies, which have greatly increased demand for the crop, both in the UK and across Europe. So the take home of all of this is that honeybees alone are not sufficient to provide pollination services in the UK and in several other countries across Europe and that we do need this diversity of pollinators to provide service, not only service delivery but service security as well into the long term.